What's going on guys and welcome back to some more Pokemon Red. In the last part, we tackled the Celadon game corner and got the Sylph Scope and uh, that's kind of helped a little bit I'll drastically back in Lavender Town. But uh, this part, we're going to tackle the uh, Celadon Gym because uh, why the hell not? We have one Pokemon that very nearly evolved in the last part, but uh, this is actually the last time in the entire game we're gonna need to cut. So uh, I guess Farfetch is gonna go on the PC after this uh, gym's over. But uh, yeah, nice little send off to uh, I'm not sure how much uh, I guess a Farfetch can kind of do well against this uh, against all grass types because uh, if you talk to this guy, eh, this gym is great. It's full of women. All right, you pervert. Anyway, so uh, now this gym's all grass types. So bring a fire type, bring a flying type. You'll obliterate this gym this is probably the first gym in the whole game that's beneficial if you chose charmander star maybe even the only gym in the whole game that's beneficial if you chose charmander but anyway we're gonna drill pack i'm gonna use drill pack a lot over the fly because drill pack's 100 percent accurate and uh, i think it has more power so uh yeah we're once we beat this weeping bell hawkwind is gonna evolve let's just say now, if we can get a Dodrio, uh, we will obliterate this gym. Well, yeah, Hawkwind's level 31. You know what this means? And we defeated Lass. You're too rough. Anyway, so what? Hawkwind is evolving. Hawkwind evolved into Dodrio. So yeah, look at the stats on this though, Rio. 83 attack, 76 speed. So uh, yeah, it's just defensive stats aren't very good, but uh, let's just say we're gonna tear up some shit with this uh, gym. Now I'm gonna fight all the trainers to make sure our Dodrio's uh, XP goes up by a lot because my goal in these next few parts is to use my other Pokemon to catch up in levels to uh, my Jigglypuff. Now, uh, yeah. Look at what we're gonna do here. That's gonna be a one shot. We're gonna clean sweep some entire teams, let's just say, but, uh, and it's actually gonna be a bell sprout right there. So another Pokemon we're gonna just clean sweep. I'd say like, uh, even though I love Fero, I'd say Dodrio is probably objectively the best flying type in this game. That's why I chose to go with it in this playthrough. And uh, plus, when you catch a Dodo on the other row, it doesn't really take long to evolve it. So, uh, get to, there, I guess this trainer only has like Oddish and Bell Sprouts, but uh, and we defeated Beauty. My makeup, <laughs> anyway. So, uh, yeah, it's all feet. It's all so well. It's also all women in this uh, gym also. So uh, there's also a really interesting bit in the Pokemon anime where Jesse and James has Ash cross-dress in order to get into Erica's gym. And then Ash being the idiot that he is, like uh, Missy's like, I wish Ash could uh, have heard all that. And Ash is like, I heard it while being cross-dressed and all that. It's like, I don't know, Ash. They've since like retired Ash Ketchum from the uh, anime because uh, he, uh, well, he, I guess he finally won the championship after two decades. So I guess they kind of gave him a send off. But uh, yeah, for the longest time, like Ash was the last remaining OG protagonist. Cause like, uh, I don't know. I haven't really kept up the uh, with the uh, anime and uh, probably since uh, X and Y. I don't know if the X and Y anime was pretty good, but uh, Anyway, so I think one of these trainers is gonna have a bit, give you a bit of a hint. Don't bring any bugs or fire Pokemon here or flying types, but uh. Yeah, flying types, fire types, bug types. Yeah, grass type, grass does have a lot of weaknesses, but um. But don't worry because we can just use our Hawkwind to, to clean sweep this world's girl scene because we didn't bring bugs. We didn't bring a flying type. We just brought, brought a three headed bird and oh, a gloom. Uh, Gloom is actually what Oddish evolves into. Uh, it'll actually evolve in a Violet Plume when you give it a Leaf Stone, but um, we should be almost level 33, come to think. 
uh, two more trainers. Um, I want to be either level 33 or 34 after the gems because, uh, I said we're just going to run out of chances to, uh, catch up with the Pokemon. But I guess it's kind of like RPGs in a nutshell, but, um, yeah, this, this, this trainer is going to go straight to the Weeping Bells, so that game, that means more XP, so I'm, t I can take that, actually. And I was going to have a Gloom, and, uh, nice. I would definitely prefer Weeping Bell over Gloom, but if, honestly, this, I just, I've said this before, but, uh, if you want a grass type, just pick Bulbasaur at the beginning of the game, or maybe uh, a Pokemon I'll I'll kind of go over later. But um, even that's a stretch. There's an Ivy source, so yeah, we might even get a level up out of this. And we get to level 33. And we feel a cool trainer. Oh, beaten. Anyway, so uh, one last trainer. Pleased to meet you. My hobby is Pokemon training. Anyway, so, uh, Beauty wants to fight, and Beauty sent out Execute. Anyway, so, um... Anyway, so, uh, let's just do his, uh, Drill Pack. Anyway, so, we defeated Beauty. So, uh, oh, splendid. Anyway, so, uh, now let's face the gym leader herself, Erica. Hello, lovely weather, isn't it? It's so pleasant. Oh dear, I must have dozed off. Welcome. My name is Erica. I'm the leader of Celadon Gym. I teach the art of flower arranging. My Pokemon are of the grass type. Well, I'm sorry. I had no idea that you wished to challenge me. Very well, but I shall not lose. Anyway, so, um... So, yeah. Erica wants to fight, and Erica sent out Victory Bell. So, uh, she's gonna go straight to the fully evolved Pokemon. And, uh, I think the Victory Bell knows, like, uh... Actually, it's the uh, Violet Plume she has. I'll get to that eventually. I forget exactly what Victory Bell's move set is, but either way, we one shot this, but it's with a critical hit, so. Might get to level four there. Now, Tangela is going to be our weakest Pokemon. Lowest level, level four, 24, and uh, not the biggest fan of Tangela, though. One time, many, many years ago in Pokemon Crystal, I found a caught and shine, a shiny Tangela while grinding at the end of the game, and I just said. Fuck it, I'll use the shiny tangle up. Anyway, so, uh, Violet Plume is gonna do Petal Dance, so, uh, I don't think we're gonna one-shot this one, though. Oh, we do, actually. Never underestimate a Dodrio. And we get to level 34. And we feed Erica. Oh, I can see defeat. You are remarkably strong. I must confer you the Rainbow Badge. We got 2071 for winning. The Rainbow Badge will make Pokemon up to level 50 obey. It also allows Pokemon to use strength in and outside of battle. Please allow take this with you. And uh, we got TM21, which is Mega Drain. Uh, we don't have any grass types, so I don't really find much worth use for this. So uh, we're just gonna go and sell it. But uh, what we actually, what I actually want to do now is uh, we can't really do much else in uh, Celadon City. However, we got the Sylph Scout. So I'd like to go back to La not to I'd like I would not like to cut, but uh I'd like to go back to Lavender Town. Because we can finally tackle something there. So uh what we're gonna do now is uh go in here. In the next part, though. So next time on Pokemon Red, we're gonna go in the uh We're gonna go in what does the sign say? We're gonna go on the Pokemon Tower. See you guys then.